Record. Warning. Pause. What you are about to see is virtual reality, but not everything is virtual. The love we have for one another is 100% real. Hey guys, so good morning. It's Sunday morning. I am out feeding the animals. Good morning, guys. Hi. I'm putting some food in for the sheepies. Okay, babies. I know you're hungry. I know you're hungry. So we're going to feed the animals real quick and get ready for church. I don't know if Lonzie's gonna wanna go. He, he's been really tired. We'll see what everybody ends up having. So I have to water trap real quick. Also, I'm get ready to go feed the cats too. So I'm helping out this morning because uh, Rich is having some back troubles. I got the kids out here helping me do chores. Okay, um, with the outdoor tours. I know. So, I know, baby, I know. So, we got the Herefords over there. We got four new Herefords. Got the little guys over here. These are jerseys. And we got some Guernseys over there. Those are riches. <laughs> you want your water? Huh? Are you thirsty? Thirsty babies? So I've got Fiona, Naomi. Uh, all the girls are out here helping. Ronnie's out there, Tempe. I know, babies. I try to get out here to feed up. <clears throat> Cause we got, we've got church like an hour and a half, two hours. And I've got to cook today. But most of the thing I need to do is already done. Ah, oh, skate. He's got to fix this thing, it's always doing that. Come on, come on. Hungry? Suck, suck. Come on. There's a Suki right here. Yeah. One of their Herefords. Come on, baby. She's mine. She's my baby right here. Come on, suck, suck, suck. Come here. Good girl. Good girl, Suks. Just doing the morning homestead chores we do every day. I just happen to be out here to feed because, uh, like I said, Rich is back with her doing bad. So I didn't even wake him up. I just was, you know what? I'll just go out here and feed. Get the kids to come help me. There was some, there was some that were up anyway. So I thought, well, let's go come out here and help me feed. Oh. No, no, wait, good, yeah. <sighs> Ouch. <laughs> oh, no, come on. Come on, silly. Come on, silly Sally. She's a merino sheep right there. Got a baby goats down here. Rich has actually got more animals than we've got. He's got more chickens and stuff like that. We've only got a few. 
But um, our homestead is pretty nice. We like it. Oh my goodness, this door is always back on enemy. Ouch. I gotta put some hay down. Ah! That door's always doing that. Come on. Ah, I know Fiona. <laughs> I know Fiona. She's frustrated. She doesn't really want to be out here, but she is usually a good helper, and so she's out here helping me. Come on. There's Saki. She's my horse. She is a Arabian. And she's beautiful. Hey, Saki. Hi. Yes? Okay. That's which is our Lonzi's pony, Petra. Right there. Still just a baby. She's uh, Leather's wife's baby from a few months ago. <laughs> oh my gosh. Farm tours are really hard, you guys. They really are hard. But they've got to be done because, oh crap, I almost knocked that over. Um, they're going to be, ooh, these troughs are bad. Ew. I know, chickies, I know you're hungry. So I sent, um, Tempe to grab the eggs because Tempe doesn't mind getting eggs for me. Fiona won't touch it, but Tempe will. Um, hey Goliath, good morning. It's only a little after six in the morning. Hi. This barn is always so dirty. Ugh. The only thing about the animals I don't like is the barn problems, like the dirty troughs and... I have no idea. YouTube. Now. YouTube. Alright, so we just came out. He's gone on the gator to get some hay. This is what it's like in the mornings down here. Since there's a lot going on. Lots to do. Anyway, do the best I can. Take care, kids. Take care, animals. I know, hush. I know you're hungry. Give me a minute here, buddy. Hey. Garfield. Hush, boy. Anyway. Do the best I can to take care of the animals. But it's hard, especially when you got sheep with that you didn't exactly. Which Jerry's coming to get those today, hopefully. I don't know if he learned how he says, but I don't always believe what my son says sometimes because he always says, oh, I'll go get it, I'll go get it. And then he sits there and attacks us and does nothing. And expects Joshua to just bring him down on the farm truck. That's not going to happen because um, we don't have time to do all that. We've got a lot going on. we got three schools our kids go to. We've got other ones starting. T-U-D-I, now. Big Moon is coming to T-U-E. Luckily, we haven't fan out here because I sweat like crazy. Although it's cold, I still sweat. <laughs> Didn't get a whole ass. Hey, Goliath, I hear you. Conan's over there. Hey, now, come on. 
I hear you. Hold on a minute. I'll get you. So it's been kind of a rough starting up this morning because the chores I've had to do. And the animals have to be tended a little earlier on Sunday because you have to make sure they're tended to. You have to make sure that everything is done and then go back in and get everything done for the breakfast. <laughs> Hey guys, so we're having breakfast. I tried to get Lonzie up. <laughs> Wasn't gonna happen. He's too tired. He said that he'd probably get up in a minute. We'll see. It's been a long week for him, which is understandable. I mean, I'm not gonna make him get up and go to church if he doesn't feel like it. I'm just not. So, <laughs> not gonna fight that battle. Because he's tired. It's been a long week for him. Well, there he is. Hi, honey. Hi, baby. I thought you were too tired. <laughs> Smelled like coffee, didn't you? Well, get on over here. Got breakfast and coffee waiting for you. <laughs> I knew if he smelled that coffee, he'd be down. And I was right. He was. There you go, buddy. So anyway, we're just getting breakfast and getting ready to go. <clears throat> he is a little better today. Oh yeah. She joined us. Usually she wants to be fed in bed, but today she joined us. And you. That's so good. <laughs> so I'm really struggling this morning. But I'm trying not to. So Katie said she's still going to make dinner. So I don't have to. Yay. <laughs> I mean, not that I'm going to making it. But it's like I have to know before. And yeah, so I get everything done. And I didn't know in time. It was frustrating me. So. Anyway. I'm tired. <sighs> so. Anyway, just going to do my Sunday chores. The animals have all been fed. I made a good breakfast. I'm proud of that. You know, just get the kids ready to go. Get my honey ready to go if he feels like going. If he doesn't, it's okay. You know, get back to a wonderful yummy dinner. Relax. Get the kids down for naps and everything else. So, that's what I'm probably going to do. Here we go, honey. Is that better? Yeah. So Tab made his homemade casserole again, guys. His homemade hot dog casserole was so good. Like him and Katie did a lot of the cooking today. Even though he had a CF crisis again. And we now have to use an oxygen tent for him. Anytime he's having trouble like that, he has to use his oxygen tent. So um, he was under it for a good while now, but he's okay. Hey, bud. You okay, honey? Yeah, you eating good, huh? So we had a good day in church. Came home to a very wonderful meal compared, uh, prepared by Katie and Trent and Tav. Um, Tav's homemade hot dog casserole is world famous. Everybody loves it. Lonzie made his homemade chicken salad, which of course everybody goes nuts over. And our friend Freddie made his Freddie nuggets. Yum, yum, yum. Doing pretty good though. Just enjoying our casserole and eating good. All the good food Trent and P uh, Katie have prepared for us. Um, Katie's like, Katie's like, Mom, you're tired. It's been a long week for you. I'm fine. Just let me prepare it. I'm fine. She's southern. So I'm pretty tired. It's been a long day. But, you know, a good morning, though. We had a good morning at church. sermon was really good. It was about, uh, you know, knowing that you're saved and knowing that God took care of everything. You know, he <clears throat> gave his life for you. And being glad that he did save you, you know. Talk a lot about things in Revelation, so it's pretty good. Pretty good. Oh my gosh. Oh lordy. I'm trying to stay awake. <laughs> anyway, doing pretty good. Kids are gonna down, go down for naps after lunch, and I think Lonzie and I might too. Um, 
Do you want some more, honey? There you go, babe. Fiona, honey, can you pass out that cash roll, please? Thank you, baby. All right, that's so good. Thank you for the coffee, honey. <laughs> so, um, I have been on a serious Dr. Pepper cake for some reason. I don't know why. Um, thank you, honey. I, I just have been, and I don't know what's up with that. But anyway, doing good. Just going to get these kids laying down for naps here a little bit. I know. Probably lay down for myself before I get up and sort, start sorting clothes again. Getting things prepared for a long week. We got to take Peter and Tab tomorrow for their uh, LFT test and a day at clinic. So, it's a lot. <laughs> so tonight, what we're gonna do for supper is like just a light, maybe sandwiches or something like that, or a char charcuterie board. I might just do that because. The truth is, guys, as much as we're eating right now for lunch, we really aren't going to need a whole lot for supper. It's, it's a lot as it is. So, yeah. Anyway, guys. Um, yeah. That's what we're doing. <laughs> hey, guys. Did you check out the coffee? Damn, what are you Because that's the heart noise is in here. <laughs> Look at this. They're sound asleep. I don't know what that noise is upstairs, but it better not be people up there. Wake. Because on Sunday afternoon, we sort of mandatorily put some people, you know, take a nap. This is our time to rest and pray. And but apparently, it's not bothering these two at all. They are knocked out. <laughs> Nothing more precious than seeing two babies sleeping. Lindsay's upstairs. Zonked. He snorts aloud right now. <laughs> I'll show you in a minute. <laughs> oh, look at this. Is there anything any more precious than these beautiful babies? Good lord. <laughs> that was Daniel. He wants a more quiet. My phone it scared the living beep out of me, you guys. Anyway, they're just over here sleeping away. You would think that would have woke him up as loud as my phone is, but it didn't. Didn't wake him up at all. Look at that. Is there anything more cuter than this? <laughs> Daniel has a lot more trouble breathing when he's sleeping, so you can hear him in a lot of areas. Elon does too, but not as bad as Daniel does. <laughs> Isn't this cute? Let's see, close up. That's how to get a close up. Look at that. Isn't that cute? <laughs> Look at that. If anyone's up upstairs, I'm gonna be upset because I tell people it's time to lay down. Or at least be quiet in your room for goodness sake. Look at that. Look at this. <laughs> so cute. So darn stinking cute, you guys. Look at that. Oh my god. Oh no. There is one. The little ones are up. Oh no. It's David. Which we don't have, have to get him back to bed. Because if he doesn't nap, he gets very cranky later, which I don't want to eat right now. Let's go check on Daddy Bear. Now let's look at Daddy Bear. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> He's knocked out. 
pretty good. Now he'll sleep till, he'll probably snore till about four. <laughs> Good Lord, baby. Tell tell us about it. <laughs> There's one other thing I want to show you that Lonzi does. If it happens, I'll show you what he does. This is also something he does. Now look at this. He's knocked out incredibly hard right now. Which is over there sleeping too. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> What cracks me up, and it's so precious, is every time he moves, he's grinding his teeth. He's sleepy. So cute. Okay, he moved again. He's going to do it again. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God, Lonzi. Lordy, baby. <laughs> Crush those tears, honey. Seven, add six, pause. And this is Daniel back over here with Daniel and Ewan. And look at this. Just like his daddy. Same thing. what he does <laughs> sometimes it's kind of like bad I wonder if it's a seizure but it's just him grinding his teeth when it gets real bad sometimes I wonder if it's a seizure because it's just Oh, that sounds painful. <laughs> There's a lot of pressure going through that right there. Youch. Here's Rich over here. He's knocked out pretty hard. Almost just scared him. I'm just scared him. Our whole family is not quiet sleepers. Trust me when I tell you. People don't want to sleep in the same room with us. Because <laughs> we're all loud. <laughs> Good Lord, Rich, tell him about it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and Dee throwing laying over here and looking at me like, what are you doing? But this is sometimes what I do after I took a nap, which I took one for about 30 minutes. And I woke up because one of the kids needed something. I just make him around checking on people. <laughs> Good Lord, Rich. He's moving. Oh, oh, he's moving. I don't know. He's moving. Oh, 
<laughs> oh my god. He's out. <laughs> ah! Ouch! He's still pretty out of it. I thought he woke up, but he didn't. <laughs> <laughs> He's a little more peaceful than me here. See, Daniel gets the grinding from me and Lonzi because Lonzi also does, but I do it too. So he gets it from both of us, he gets it from both hands. <laughs> it's actually hilarious. Because he gets it from me and his daddy. <laughs> it's funny. <laughs> it's hilarious, actually. Let's see if he does any more. <laughs> I made me think of uh, the time when uh, a friend of mine caught my other friend of mine sleeping and you hear Christmas, Christmas time is near you <laughs> friend sleeping. Hi sleepyhead. There's my baby. You gonna wake up? You gonna wake up me? Huh? He's awake. Hi honey. Oh, stretching. He's been asleep for about four hours, almost five. One hour. He's tired. Hi, sweetheart. Good afternoon. You gonna wake up me? You gonna get up me? <coughs> Good afternoon, honey. I think he's deciding if he wants to get up or not. We'll see if he does or not. I think he is. Oh, so sleepy face. So sleepy. Hi, oh, Yenny. There's my beautiful baby. Okay, so I got him up. He's up. He's watching his race. Happy as a lark. I finally got him up. I'm over here right now with Peter. He's on oxygen. He's been having some breathing issues. Um, it was a kind of rough situation, but he's okay. Good thing we have clinic tomorrow, because if we did it, there would be a problem. Mr. Wood. Anyway. <sighs> so we had a charcuterie board supper. Are you guys good? YouTube. 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 Now. So Rich finally got up to... We're just doing some washing, just the rest of the washing. I know I usually don't do chores on Sunday, but guys, if I don't, who's going to? Honestly, if I don't, who will? <laughs> That's how I do it. Anyway, so I'm just doing the washing. I've got Peter under his oxygen right now because he's just having a lot of breathing issues. Also on his vent. So we go on uh, 8 o'clock in the morning to do our all the CF stuff. Um, Tab's under his oxygen right now. He's still sleeping, actually. Oh, no, he's not. Hi, honey. Hi, Tab Tabs. Hi, sweetie. Sleep okay? Yeah? Okay. So he's very tired. Um, he did not have a good night last night, and he still continues to have breathing really good issues today. So we'll see what really goes on. We'll see what we're going to do. Uh, what ends up happening with him and Peter. So here's Peter under his oxygen. Hey buddy, you okay, honey? Hi, sweetheart. I know you don't feel that good, do you, honey? So we're, we're having to use the mask on him because unfortunately uh, with him, he can't do the nasal camera. His nose is too stopped up. He has a deviated symptom plus he has bad nasal issues. So, some mask over here. I've got his ventilator hooked up too. 
My sweetheart. You okay, Petey? Yeah, I know you don't feel good. I'm sorry. I really hope we don't end up staying in the yard, like in the hospital tomorrow with him. Um, with him and Tav, because Peter has not been doing too well with the heat. With like that change of, there's no heat, but there's just like the change in weather and just not doing well. So. Hey, Bubba's. You okay? So because he isn't well, I've got him under his oxygen. I got the moisture going too, because he needs that. This is a higher flow than we're usually using. This is about six liters. And he's been on high flow before too. Amazon Alexa, now Denver Nuggets. Anyway guys, I'm probably gonna get these kids to put to bed and everything pretty soon and just get the last minute things I gotta do done. <clears throat> we have to get up really super early in the morning because Pete has to be there by eight. Petey. Just give him his meds. He's very tired. You tired, my lovey? You tired, huh? Yeah. Okay, sweetie. <clears throat> okay, sweetheart. Okay, sweetheart. <clears throat> so I'm gonna get these kids put to bed. It's a little after eight. Um, 30. So, Lonzie's watching a few things on TV. I'm not on TV, but on his, his iPad and doing a couple of work things. <clears throat> then we're going to bed. So, anyway, guys, I love y'all so much. I will talk to you tomorrow. And just know you are loved. You are awesome. And I love you so much. Bye. Say bye, Pete. Bye-bye.